Hi, so we're now going to be evaluating algebraic expressions. So again, expressions are just a number sentence without the equal sign. Algebraic means there's um, variables involved, and then evaluate means to solve. Um, so before, in that last, pa uh, in that last worksheet, um, we couldn't solve because we didn't know what the unknowns were. But now they're saying, well, here's your expression, um, that variable is equal to 3. Now that you know what that is, solve it. Um, so they give you an example. Um, M is 3, so we're going to substitute, meaning we're replacing the variable with the number. Um, this doesn't make it 53, right? This is 5 times 3 uh, plus 26. So I like how they added the parentheses there to indicate that's multiplication um, not the number 53. Uh, we're checking this person's work. So 5 times 3 is 15, plus 26 is not 31. So their computation in that last step was incorrect. So what they want you to do, if it's correct, um, you're going to leave it. But if it's incorrect, you are going to cross out and then add your own work to the side and um, correct their work. Um, so I would be checking for just computation, make sure their computation was correctly, maybe they're not substituting right, um, and maybe they're not following order of operations. So order of operations uh, is the order which we need to solve in. So PEMDAS, parentheses, exponent, multiplication, or division, addition, or subtraction. Um, so yeah. Uh, check your answer to problem two by using a different strategy. So there's those parentheses, right? Uh, this other strategy that they're talking about, I think they're hinting at the distributive property. Um, so that may be another way we could solve there. All right. I don't think there's another page of this. Nope. So um, just check their work. Make sure you're substituting and um, following the correct order. Maybe a good way to do this is just do your, your own work off to the side for all of them and then compare your work to theirs to see if it was correct. Um, that's how I would probably do it. If you have another way, you can do it. Um, but I think that is everything for evaluating. So substitute and then solve. All right. Goodbye, guys.